Right, let's have a look to see what we've got here. We've got a few bits and bobs for this KX80. We've got a throttle tube, which, you know, throttle sleeve, Kawasaki, should be fine. Should fit. We've got a set of grips, nice green ones. Let's see if you had a good grip, I'd probably have a few ones myself. And we've got, uh, this is a clutch lever. Hopefully it will fit. Can't see why it wouldn't unless that's a bit thicker. Which uh, uh, could be the case, but I don't know. Look. I hope it does fit because he was fannying around taking ages to um, to buy the clutch lever and brake lever. And uh, I kind of encouraged him and I just said, look, just take a, just take the risk and get one. Because he couldn't find one that was said KX80. But you never know, somebody might have changed that perch. So he just got this one. That was for an 85, for a KX85. So hopefully that fits, and we've got the front brake lever, same situation, so hopefully that fits. I'm not sure why they're all different brands, but oh, those are the same brand, and we've got a different brand front brake lever. So, let's get fitting them, shall we? clutch on to tell you the truth the clutch feels like it's at it um new clutch lever new brake lever the perch thing's broken so i've had to put a big washer on it it's a bit loose but it works all right new grips on new throttle tube that all works perfectly fine the only thing we ain't got is a kickstart so i'm going to put the old kickstart that come with it on it just so i can give it a so i can start it up and i can see whether it's actually going to move you know, whether, it's, whether the clutch has had it or whether it actually moves under its own steam. Because don't forget, this is the first time it's I've ever tried to you know, make it move. So we'll see what happens. God! Fucking kickstart, I tell ya! Don't know why he won't just buy a bloody kickstart for it, man. Jesus, you gonna fuck up the splines. That's what it's going to do. Keep using a shit one that don't fit. It's just going to mess it up. And it'll never work. Needs to buy a bloody kickstart, dude. That's what he needs to do. Trouble is, what we're getting here now, the kickstart, the only fucking, the only kickstart that I've got, that this is the one that came on, it's a shitty Chinese one, don't know what the hell it's for, load of crap. It doesn't fit on this spline very well, it doesn't fit on this um, splines. And no matter how tight you do that up, it doesn't grip. That is the trouble, and it's just gonna, it's just gonna ruin. It's just gonna strip out those splines, and then when you do get a real kickstart, it ain't gonna work. It's because a real kickstart is sixty quid, sixty pounds. That's what a kickstart is, and he won't spend that money on it. And uh, well, he's just gonna ruin it because he's gonna have to get a new spline, which means taking the engine apart. So uh, keep saying, you know, just get the parts you need. Is what I always say. Just get them. It might be expensive, but it's, you're going to have to do it. If you want it to work, you've got to do it. It's a lesson I've learned over the years. Because 
I spent ages cheaping out, not getting things I need or buying cheap parts, and in the end you just end up spending more money and wasting more time because you have to replace other bits what them cheap parts break anyway. So if you just spend the money and get the real part, usually you're alright. So, ah, oh, mate. But at least I've got these on. All this is good. I think the clutch has had it though because it's on a full adjustment and it's uh, it don't like it. And you can't move the spindles. The only other way I could do it is if I take this. You can't even take the housing off because that's all one piece. All that there is all one piece. Usually, on like on the RM, you can take the housing off and move the spindle splines on the inside. The little, little rod that goes down there, but you can't do it on this one. So that's that. Another hurdle block. But, you know, I've told him many times he won't buy a kickstart, so there we go, that's that.